Sophie Woodlawn premiered in Birmingham tonight. A great crowd showed up and lined the red carpet as stars made their way into the movie. WIT 42 News reporter Alex Finney followed all the action, chatting it up with the stars and the excited fans. Sherry and Jim, more than 2,700 people showed up for the premiere tonight here at Carmike, and I spoke with the directors who said the film may be pretty Hollywood, but the root of it is right here in Birmingham. Oh, Woodlawn is a, a film that's intrinsically Alabama, and so we did our premiere out in L.A., but we said it is critical for us to come celebrate with the hometown folks. And boy, did Birmingham celebrate a band, crowds of screaming fans, and the red carpet that went on for days. Y'all are the nicest people ever. Sherry Shepard wowed the red carpet. She plays the role of Mama Nathan, who was also here for the premiere, walking arm in arm with Papa Nathan. She's such an amazing spirit and so strong, and just to be able to portray her and get this message of hope and faith out to the masses. I'm just honored to be a part of it. The movie tells the story of the Woodlawn High School football team back in the 1970s, a time of real racial divide in Birmingham. The main character, Tony Nathan, uses his faith and talent to break through the racial tensions. Birmingham native Caleb Castile plays the role of Tony. Tony was a person who would uh, allow his actions to speak for him. And um, that's something that I think everybody can learn from. Prepping for the film was a process and a cold one. They shot outside during the winter. And I had to put a wetsuit under my wardrobe um, because it was freezing cold in the middle of winter. I was not expecting this at all. At all. Um, I was expecting maybe, you know, a couple people here and there. This is incredible. Woodlawn took up 12 of the 14 screens here at Carmike, and the movie officially hits theaters tomorrow. In Hoover tonight, Alex Finney, WIAT 42 News. Coverage you can count on.